the reason I stress using ideals so much in my video is because ideals are basically indicators that allow you to know where to go in life. Because in life, there's no such thing as a north. There are many norths. Every area of your life has its own north. And you have to learn to identify what areas of life matter to you the most. That way, you can know what to always attack and put energy in. So if you've ever had a situation where you spent a lot of time and energy on a project or a job or a relationship and then looked back you know, in retrospect and said, wow, that was a waste of time, all that means is that you are not either are not currently or were not uh, in control and aware of your ideals. Your ideals aren't something that you need to create. There's something that you discover that's already in you. It's like a hot, cold game where you know you get closer to the thing. It's like, yeah, it's getting hotter, 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 colder, colder, colder. So yeah, it's basically like that game. Now, uh, the idea is that when you identify the ideals, you always know where hotter is and you're not just guessing. And then you can choose what I call a vehicle, meaning a, a path in life. You know, a vehicle could be a job, a relationship, a location. A vehicle is anything that helps you get from one place to another uh, for your, you know, your life goals, basically. And um, you discover your ideals, again, they're, they're basically things that you always know you're gonna want. They're like values. They're things that you aspire to. I like to use the word ideals because it just, it just makes more sense to me. So for example, my ideals are you know, being famous, uh, being healthy, being fit, um, helping people and especially coaching, that's a big ideal for me. Um, being kind of mindful and calm and you know, a bunch more. But, but, but the, the main idea here is that when you identify these ideals, you can you know what sort of avenue to go to in life. So, for example, one of my ideals is growth. I must have growth to be happy. Whatever it is I'm doing, if it's not related to growth, I'm not happy. Doesn't matter if it's a relationship or a job or, or anything. Whatever I do, I need it to be something that can continually grow. So, when I was working uh, two years ago, you know, doing the coaching, uh, making a lot of money, barely you know working a couple of hours a week. I was not happy, I was not satisfied. And the reason I wasn't satisfied was because I wasn't growing, I stopped growing. So I missed one of the ideals. Hope that makes sense. So you discover your ideals by basically either with a coach or by sitting down and asking yourself, what are the things that I always wanted, I always will want, and they're not gonna change. And then you create an ideal out of it. So it can't be like $10,000. It's not something numerical that can be more or less. It has to be like a, an infinite destination that you can always aspire to. So I, I always want to be more famous. I always want to be more healthier. I always want to be more fit, you know. So these are things that you don't, these are not goals. These are, goal, these are things that you go towards infinitely and you basically la base your life around. So for example, one of my ideals is also freedom. So whatever I do, I know that it has to be related to growth. It has to be related to coaching or not stop me from coaching. And it has to be something where I'm free, where I can just move. Again, online business, coaching, you know, helping people, constantly growing. It fits the mold, okay? It's also about being famous. You know, I, can, I also can get fit while doing it. So it basically answers all of my, all of my requirements. And that's how you, your ideals can basically help you become more... Um, more successful, more, uh, more happy. So this is like kind of a quick overall look at ideals. There's so much more to talk about. I can make like a two hour video just on this topic. But tell me what about ideals like interests you the most or, or you think could help you the most and I'll make sure to elaborate on that. So thanks for watching. Subscribe if you haven't and contact me for coaching if you're interested.